Welcome to Maria's channel. This quick and fun tutorial on using the draw pen in Canva. Whether you're a design enthusiast or just starting, the draw pen tool opens up a new world of creativity. In this video, Maria will guide you step by step on how to use it to add personal touches, custom illustrations, and unique flair to your designs. So grab your stylus or just your mouse and let's create something amazing together. Hi guys, it's Megan Maria and now today I'm going to show you guys how you can use the drawing apps inside of Canva. I think I created a video a long, long time ago about it, but uh, some features changed, uh, Canva updated some of the features, so I want to try again. So you can do the drawings, you can do a tracing, or you can create your own uh, images if you want to, if you are good on drawing. But I'm not good on drawing, just want to let you know guys and show you how you can do your, your drawing thing and uh, tracing and you know, uh, get some uh, images already inside of Canva and all you're gonna do is just to trace it and put a dot to dot if you want to create a dot to dot activity for kids you can do that inside of Canva all right so now we're here in Canva and we're going to start with a presentation so I can show you guys where is the uh, the pen okay the draw pen okay so let's click the presentation and here on your left side you will see a lot of icons here and then you will see this draw pen if you cannot find the draw pen just click the apps and then type on the search bar a uh, draw pen okay click the draw pen and now here are the pens that you can use this pen is for you know easy uh, very thin this one is just a little bit you know and this one is some kind of a marker just like that and this one is for the eraser if you make a mistake just a click one click and then you can erase whatever mistake you had and then here are the colors of your pen you can weight it up into you know how much thick you want or how much thin you want here are the colors of the pen like for example you choose this one and then click the color and there are a lot of colors here to choose from all right so if you click this one and click the red color, then you can choose any color that you want. So here are the colors of your pen. Okay, so for example, guys, we want to, uh, okay, I'm gonna give you an example on how you can draw your own without using any tracing or things like that. So for example, you wanna draw something. Okay, I'm gonna use a green or I can change the color if I wanna make it red or black, purple, just like that. And then let's say you wanna, you wanna use this one and then you can also you know wait here on how much big do you want it or let's say just like that transparency oh, okay if you want to do a hundred percent well it's up to you so just just like that okay so i'm gonna use this one and let's say i want to draw some uh a bear okay like for example let's make a, a round and then we're gonna put you know ears oh it's too big right so i make a mistake what i'm gonna do is click this one and just click wherever you make a mistake just like that and it will uh you know erase everything okay let's do it again so let's make a round like that this is like a bare face then we're going to make a ear like that oh my god my drawing is not good and then we're gonna make our eyes here like that and then a nose nose here just like that and all right so you can draw whatever you want all right you can draw a bear you can draw a cat you can draw a dog whatever it is okay so next i'm gonna show you guys i want to do some tracing since i'm not good on drawing <laughs> all right so we're going to the elements here and here on the search bar let's type bear and then he, there you see a lot of bear and i'm gonna do the graphics so that i can just copy in and you know trace it whatever you want okay so there you go there are so many bear here so let's say i'm gonna get this uh this one all right so this is what i uh trying to draw but i can't because i'm not good at drawing so there are a lot of things that you can do okay so first if you want to go and trace this one then you can trace it okay so to do that we're going to trace this uh bear but it you can also uh, adjust the transparency of the bear if you want to trace it just like that okay like for example if you want to work with kids and you want the kids to trace the bear and after 
they finish it and then they can see the shape of the bear and you know it's all in here the ears the eyes and the nose okay so let's say you want to trace this one just print it and give it to your kids so even though they don't know how to draw then they can just trace it you can then go to the trace okay and click the pen that you want to use so for example you want to use this okay i'm gonna change the color to this one and then i might make this a little bit thicker okay just like that so all right, let's just trace this one just like that. And then after that, let's trace the ears just like that. And then let's go to the eyes. There are a lot of easy elements, guys, that you can choose from and you can play with it with your kids or let your kids do it. Okay, so let's say let's go back again to the bear and get that bear again here. There you go. So let's say you want to do a dot to dot for the kids like 1 to 10 or 1 to 20. You can do that also here on the draw pen. Okay, so let's say click the draw pen and let's say I'm going to use this one. And okay, let's say if you want to use the, the red one, then let's say the red one. Okay, and let's weigh it. Uh, okay, maybe like this one so that kids can see how big the dot is. And then we can just place the dots somewhere where you want to do so let's say for example this is one this is two right then this is three four five right then six seven eight nine ten eleven twelve thirteen fourteen 15 16 17 or we can put wherever you want so that kids can just follow the dots until they make the the shape of the uh pair that they want okay so i'm gonna put more dots in here in the middle especially if you're working with small kids you know they cannot like you know really go straight ahead of the uh the dot to dot the dot so you can do this as well okay if you're just practicing on uh, pencil gripping so you can use this one just let them you know follow the dot so they can practice how to hold a pencil uh, if you're not uh, focusing on numbers then you can also do this just let them connect all the dots together just like that so that they can make this uh, all right so now once we have finished with that we already put all the uh, the dots here then we're going to click all of this or we can you can, i'm gonna group this one okay i'm gonna group this one and click the transparency and then you can just uh slide this down a little bit or you know just like that so they can see it a little bit all right and then now they're going to start tracing with it uh using this uh dot to dot so if i use this one okay let's make this a little bit mm okay just a little bit just like that so now they can start doing the dot thing from here they can follow here connect to here connect to that 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 and it doesn't matter if it is not perfect guys it doesn't matter they're just kids and they love seeing what they made they're very proud of it so now they say oh i created a bear things like that right so if they want to color this they can do that by clicking this one and choose the color they want if the bear is brown and then now they can start you know uh coloring the bear just like that you know it's fun to do things together with you and with your kids yeah i'm just showing you guys i'm not doing this all together coloring and things like that big but just want to let you know that inside of canva you can do the drawing you can do the tracing you can do coloring and you can do the that to that thing for your little ones all right so yeah that's all for today guys i hope uh you learned something from this and if you have any questions just let me know that in the comments and i will respond to you as soon as possible and for those of you who are new to my channel please don't forget before you leave please subscribe to my channel and and, uh, click the notification bell so that you get notified every time I upload a video every week and uh, you know 
uh, click the like and share this video <laughs> and for all my subscribers thank you so much guys for all your support and we've done for this year 2024 and uh thank you so much for all your support and for the next year i hope you're still here with me and uh let's do it together let's support each other and join to our community thank you so much guys for watching and happy holidays bye for now